Do you ever have one of those days when you wake up feeling so good you gotta just rush outside and film a time lapse of the sunrise? Today is the H2O edition. We're gonna talk about chickens and water. Now like us, chickens are about 70% water. Eggs are about 70% water, and thus chickens are extremely prone to dehydration. And when they do get dehydrated, it can be very dangerous for their health. So I always keep two waters out here in the chicken yard. This is just your standard poultry fountain. And inside the coop, we've got a heated poultry fountain, so it won't freeze in the winter. They just follow me around every time I come out here. All right, so one of the most important things is to keep these things full and to keep them clean. A lot of the crazier poultry farmers say they should be so clean that you would drink out of it. You should see the looks these girls give me when I get down on my hands and knees and drink out of these things. So let's get these waters cleaned out and filled up. Now because it's winter, and because I have the world's most understanding wife, I have this indoor setup where I can clean and refill all my poultry waters. But for the heated water, it's got this little tiny plug on the bottom and I don't know how they expected anybody to be able to fill this thing in the winter because it doesn't really fit under a faucet. So I got this little adapter for my faucet and I just hooked up a little piece of hose. This is just garden hose and I just cut off the end and here's how we fill it up. You shove it down in there and it fills it up super fast. This is not a time lapse. So like I said, it's really important to keep the waters clean. I use a couple of different techniques to really keep them clean. One is the chain. So it suspends the water several inches off the ground and not really much dirt gets in there. The other thing I do is a trick I picked up from Justin Rhodes on his YouTube channel. And that's to kind of suspend a pallet. That way, whenever they get up on the pallet, the dirt falls off their feet and they go to the water and no dirt gets in the waterer. You can also set your water up on a cinder block, but if you put your water on the ground, it's gonna get destroyed. Just warning you. You wanna observe your chickens on a daily basis. Make sure they don't look dehydrated. Make sure they look healthy. If they look unhealthy, there's a good chance that they're dehydrated. They sell little packets of electrolytes at the farm store. I get mine at Rural King. It's just a powder similar to Gatorade that you add to the water and it helps keep them hydrated. You can also put honey in the water. You can also put a little bit of apple cider vinegar and it helps to keep them healthy as well. So that's probably way more than you ever wanted to know about chickens and water. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button. And if you haven't shared this vlog with a friend yet, if you're enjoying it, please share it with a friend. And we will see you tomorrow.